One of the most effective and affordable ways to change your decor and give your home a refresh through the seasons is by switching up the florals. And in today's video, I have so many to share with you. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are at Michael's. I'm going to be doing my yearly video of the spring florals for 2023. If you like this video, I really hope you can consider subscribing. And without any further ado, let's just jump right in. I am sure I'm not the only one, but the first thing I think about when I think of spring is all the colorful and beautiful florals. And this is not the first time I've said it in my channel, but I think Michaels has one of my favorite ones, such a great selection with beautiful colors. The best part is that all of this decor is going to be 40% off. So you just have to subtract that percentage amount to the amount you're seeing on the tags that I'm showing on the video. I'm going to start with a few vases right here. We are going to see a small selection of vases throughout this entire video, but also wreaths, garlands, and decorative florals that you can do so many things with them. I like creating my own wreaths. I've always said that in my channel. So this is a great place to come when you are doing such projects. I found this set of bud vases for $30 and then this wreath, I think this wreath didn't have a tag, but if I had to guess, this is going to be $60 before discounts because that's the price for all the wreaths in Michaels for years now. I don't know how they haven't changed this price. I don't know how they can be so expensive though, but I also really love this one right here. I think this one screams spring. I'm not too much of a yellowy person in my decor, but I must say that in outdoor areas, I can definitely see how this can bring a lot of life to your front porch. $60 for that one as you can see there. And of course, a beautiful selection of spring florals in silk flowers and they have these separated in the store by set of colors. So this will be where you will find all of your yellow flowers. They do have some greenery stems like this one right here for just under $4, but I'm not going to be pulling in or out every single floral. I am going to try to give you examples on the price and I'm gonna try to give you a look of everything they have in shots like this one that I'm filming right here. They do have also a lot of pre-made arrangements like this one for $60. I do think this is a little bit pricey. It is beautiful indeed, but I think this is the kind of things that will look better if you did it with natural um, or real tulips. But these are very cute as well. If anything, you can always create these types of arrangements yourself. I really do like the woven basket at the bottom. And this is a smaller arrangement with more neutral colors. The yellow in those flowers is definitely very pastel. These right here, I'm not too crazy about. You can even see the glue at the bottom so that the stems don't move. This is something that also Target brings out a lot. And if you can tell that there's something having those stems fixed at the bottom of the vase, then I don't like it. If you're gonna do that, then use a dark vase where you cannot tell. These I thought were so pretty, just as they are. I love that for that entire bunch, you're only paying $13. You can definitely create a full arrangement only with a bunch of these. And it actually kind of looks like a bouquet to me. Then these right here are perfect to add to any centerpiece. And these you can cut into individual stems and put around all the centerpiece or you can definitely use them in a larger vase for $13. I really love the movement that these bring to the table. I'm so sorry my camera was not focusing right there, but as you can see, just $12.99. And I also really like the neutral colors. These actually look like they're natural flowers, which is one thing I really, really like. If you're gonna use silk flowers, make sure that they at least look a little bit natural. These right here, I love the pinkish, peachy tone they have. I think they are completely, absolutely charming for $10 and that's just one bunch what I have on my hand. We have another beautiful and colorful spring-like wreath 
This one is going to be $60, very expensive. I would rather doing it myself. However, I still like looking at wreaths in the store just to grab inspiration and ideas on how to create my own. That one in the center is actually going to be $40, which is the first time I see a more affordable wreath at Michael's. But out of those three wreaths you just saw in the frame, let me know in the comment section down below which one is your favorite. I really love the natural organic look of this one, but I also really like the little pops of colors with those flowers right there. And if your favorite color is pink, you cannot tell me this section right here is not beautiful. I love so many of the colors that I'm seeing and definitely it's really hard to pick a favorite faux flower from everything I'm seeing here. So we have the colored baby's breath, which they also have in white, which I'll show you later in the video. But these right here are so pretty. I love that the greenery for the flowers is kind of like that toned down green, which I feel like in other craft stores, you don't see these colors. And I just think it looks better the way Michaels sells it for $8 each. Down here, we also have these, which come with longer leaves, and I just really, really like the color contrast. I feel like when the green is a little bit toned down, you can actually appreciate the colors of the flowers a little bit better. It looks even a little bit more expensive to me. But that's my own preference. These right here are going to be $10 each. For more vibrant colors, they have these down here, and I use very similar one flowers and decorative stems to create my Easter wreath of last year. I still have that wreath, it's a little bit destroyed because it basically didn't survive the move, but I'll see if I can find a picture of that one and put it in this video. I really love how that wreath turned out, and I actually remember buying all of these stems from Michaels. Okay, I found some decorative or decorated trucks right here. They have those spring florals. If you have one of these trucks, you can definitely add some florals in the bed of the truck. But if you don't have the patience, the ability, or the time to create those projects, then that is a great option right there. I also found these right here. I really love that tone of lavender that these have. As you can see, the sh shade of the green and the leaves is a little bit more brighter, $5 per bunch and I'm holding exactly one bunch in my hand. And then in here I have a selection of garlands that can be great to decorate a fireplace mantle, you can decorate your dining room table, you can decorate a kitchen island. If you are, however, using these on a place where you're going to eat, I think it'll look a little bit better if you lay these with a table runner. It will just make the look a little bit more elaborated, a little bit more completed, but if you're just placing them on a fireplace mantle then I think you can get away with just using those alone. How beautiful is this wreath? I mean I love the combination of all the florals. I know it may look a little bit over the place but this is just an example of how Michaels can sell any wreath which means you can create anything and make it look like if it's something that came out of the craft store if you know what I mean and I still think that wreath is beautiful. Now in here I have some modern vases and these are actually very, very nice. They look like very expensive vases that you may find at Target. These right here have a very weird shape, if I'm honest. Not necessarily my favorite. This one right here is $27, but this is just an example of Michaels being versatile and trying to cater to different styles and you can definitely create something very modern off of these. I think I prefer this one a little bit better. The shade is a bit orangey but you can definitely incorporate it into different styles of decor like a more modern style of decor or even a mid-century modern style of decor. Okay, 
Let's talk about these head bases. That's how I like to call them. Anthropology came out with these, I think a year ago, and they were super expensive, but after that, they were also very, very popular. And now Michaels, TJ Maxx are coming up with them. That one was actually really heavy right there. I think it's very beautiful if you like a romantic style of decor, maybe even a little bit of a bohemian style of decor. And then in here, I have some more options for those vases these will be great to pair with a farmhouse style of decor and the iridescent one on the left will be great for the sunnier months of the year we have another beautiful wreath and this one is so pretty i love the pastel colors that one is also going to be $60 and then we have some more vases right here we have those once on the left, they have that iridescent effect as well. They resemble a kettle pot for $22. And look how beautiful and delicate these are. They also have these that you can actually incorporate into a more coastal style of decor for $23 each. And then down here, they have these that come in a set of three for $17, including that metal tray at the bottom. I think it's a great deal. And this will look very beautiful even on its own. And worth mentioning that those faces are glued down to the tray. These probably are my favorite florals. I love the toned down pastel colors and I pulled a bunch here and I think I kind of struggled to get that price tag because this wasn't marked. And I know unfortunately I couldn't find a price for these, but these are so pretty. The good thing about these is that you don't have to do any thinking about how to pair these flowers because they come in that bunch or bouquet already. So the thought process was already made for you. We have some more garlands here. Some of them are just greenery. Some of them are on the more neutral side, which I know a lot of you may prefer. Let me know in the comment section down below though, which one is your preferred type of floral? Would you like the colorful bright ones, the pastel toned down ones, or the more neutral ones? I'm kind of in between the neutral and the pastels, but I still love a good vibrant floral just at least to look at it in the store. I think it looks very pretty. Okay, I found these other small little decorations here and I really love that ceramic little dish. As you can see, it looks very oriental and I love the pastel color and these are actually very affordable. You have a pink version and a blue version, which is this one. These that are all inside a teacup are so pretty as well for $12.99. And a good way to use these is into tear trays or decorated trays. And with that, my friends, I am going to close on this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. Let me know in the comment section down below what is your favorite item that I share with you in this video. Subscribe if you haven't done so already, and I really hope I can see you in my next one. Bye. I'm sick of love songs.